the issues um, that we were dealing with, were, it, they, were, they were challenging, but I will say I have never seen a group of people that came together like the Des Moines group. I love a challenge. Don't tell me I can't do something. We banded together, we worked together. The culture and people of Des Moines, I would say, are uh, good Midwestern people, <laughs> like you would expect. They are a salt of the earth, uh, outgoing, friendly, a wonderful community, very family oriented. We were launching Keller Williams in, in kind of virgin territory. There weren't any other Keller Williams that were anywhere close nearby, so we were a relatively unknown name, unknown. We were still Keller Who at that point. Certainly, anytime you're bringing a new product to the market, there's you, you expect challenges. We didn't expect to have this level of adversity early on. I guess in my mind, I expected it. Not really maybe to the severity that they did, but yeah, I expected to be challenged on getting any kind of compensation from the one dollar to the legal troubles, all of it, I mean, it weighed heavily, very heavily. In my position, I, get, I had the unique ability to speak with a lot of agents on a personal level about all of their struggles they were having. You know, whether they were experiencing medical bills, they were trying to pay for their ch children's tuition, or just trying to put food on the dinner table. Watching agents come off of a transaction uh, where they had had that uh, euphoria almost of finding a great house for someone and feeling really good about getting through the process and then walking away and then asking how they were going to pay their bills, basically, uh, you knew something had to happen. One of the things we were able to do is create a local fund. Um, so we were able to give our associates um, about 25% of the commissions they would have received, so they were getting something. I was really excited. I was one of the original ALC members uh, from the very beginning. And so we knew, I mean, in those very early ALC meetings, we knew that we needed to do something to help people, to be able to make a car payment, to be able to do something. I think it was a really neat atmosphere to walk into and see everybody unified. I think it actually helped bond the, the office together and to walk in and feel that, that unity I think was really cool. To tell someone that's thinking about joining you that they're going to get something when they have one of these sales, um, to not get an entire commission is, is a difficult thing. Those were times that we had to ask ourselves some hard questions about how, how the, long we could sustain that. And with the advent of the Family Fund, um, it was just the most remarkable example of culture. You never could have suggested to me that something like that would happen. Today, in this room, we are going to make you whole. And then when they said we were going to be fully reimbursed, um... It was really nice to know that I had gotten involved with a company that truly cares. It was amazing to see this great big family become a small family and take care of this little place in Des Moines, Iowa. My experience that day, what I really thought to myself is I thought the cavalry has arrived. To experience 80,000 associates coming to your rescue, people that don't necessarily know us, strangers who are willing to dip into their pockets, and contribute so that we can continue to do the right thing and, and take the high road. It was, it was an incredibly powerful experience. It's really hard to put something like that into words. There definitely is that look of determination and desire whenever a check was received that we had to get through this, that we didn't want to continue to receive benefit from our peers, even though it was overwhelmingly gratitude. When we found that there was a settlement, there was lots of cheers and there were lots of tears because it was very emotional. We focused on the outcome of 
not having to have the family fund in Des Moines anymore. It was such an amazing feeling to make it go away. Um, and to be to play a role in that, as hard as it was for 18 months, um, it was pretty cool. It was great fun to walk through the office and, and start to hear the buzz. And then it got louder and then there were hugs and there were high fives and there were cheers and everybody was just looking for someone else to talk to about it. As we've gone to company-wide events, um, everything from, oh, you're from Des Moines, let me hug you. Uh, let me support you, how can I help you? So many offers of, of support from uh, everyone. The entire Keller Williams family, we'd just like to say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To everyone who supported us from our international leadership to our agents in the market centers donated on their green sheets, the MCAs who have helped support us and the team leaders and OPs, I just want to say thank you. It's amazing what your gift has given our market center, what we've been able to do, and thank you for the honor of being able to distribute those checks to our agents.